Today we will be showing you how to replace a power supply in a Juniper EX series switch. This video only applies to the non-line card style of EX series switches that have removable power supplies. If you have a line card style EX series switch, we have a separate video for that power supply replacement. To begin, you will need to determine if your machine has redundant power supplies. You can check this from the console CLI using the command shown on screen. This will display the current condition of the power supplies in your machine. You can also verify from here which power supply has failed if you have redundant power supplies. If you have a single power supply that has failed, but your switch has not shut down, you will need to shut it down properly. If you have redundant power supplies, you can skip this step. To shut down the switch, log into the CLI and use the command shown on screen to shut down your switch properly. Once it is off, you can move to the physical switch to perform the replacement. Once you have identified which power supply has failed, detach the power cable from it. Then use a Phillips screwdriver to undo the captive screw holding the power supply in place, if there is one. Undo the latch and slide the power supply out of the switch. Install the replacement, ensuring the latch is seated firmly before using the screwdriver to tighten down the captive screw. Then reattach the power cable. If this was a single power supply machine, the switch will now boot up and you will need to wait and then log into the CLI. Once in the CLI, you will want to use the command shown on screen to show the chassis hardware and ensure everything is back to a functional state with no alarms. If you have any issues with your power supply replacement, please reach out to us at support at the rocketplatform.com and we will assist you.